Hi, you want to know about p-value? Well, what's p-value? Mm, I usually hear about it in studies. Like, ooh, we found that eating eggs does not raise blood level cholesterol with a p-value of 0 0.05. And you go like, what? what does that mean? Well, let's take a practical example. Well, there's a pizza place near my home that they say, we deliver pizza at most 30 minutes. Yeah, if it's over, the pizza is yours. And I go like, hmm, let's test this. So I go in, I call them a bunch of times, and I order a bunch of pizzas, and I plot all the times, all the results. Like this. T. 30 minutes. And I go like, one pizza, one pizza, pizza. Pizza, 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 and I got a lot of free pizza. <laughs> that there's about like about seventy percent chance of the pizza place the pizza delivers being over thirty minutes. So that's that would be a p value of about zero point seven, which is huge. You're like what? Seventy percent chance that the pizza times is gonna be over thirty minutes? Okay, but if you had, if I had, uh, if I had access to their data, like all the delivery times <coughs> that they ever did, and they, uh, and it looked more like this. With a bunch, much more delivery times over here, a few over here, a few over here. according to their data, then having gotten a lot of samples here is pretty unlikely. It was it's what? About 30%? This? So, according to their data, me getting all these unlucky delivery times would be about 30% chance a p value of 0.3. You're like, oh. So a p value is going to be, it's going to tell you how likely it is to have a bunch of samples that point in one conclusion, delivery times being likely to be over 30 minutes, but actually are unlucky draws from the other conclusion delivery times are likely to be under 30 minutes in studies they actually put a arbitrary value and say that okay the results are significant we believe these results if the BP value is under 0.05 or the equivalent with a significance value of 5%. This is an arbitrary value, and most people say, ah, this is small enough. The p-value is small enough if it's 0 0.05. And usually, to compute the p-value, you use software. Uh, put the data in the, the statistical software, and yeah, go. And the p-value pops out. And now, if you want to learn about how to compute it by hand, well, Gotta check out my next video. <laughs> this is it. P-value.